Hello and welcome to Jeanette's TV and Jeanette's TV Podcast. I'm your host Jeanette Burke, live on the red carpet for day two of the Canadian Screen Actors Awards. This time we're focusing on cinematic and television series. We're going to be seeing Ryan Reynolds, Catherine O'Hara and many more stars. And if you haven't already done so, please click the link below to subscribe to our YouTube channel. I also want to remind you that you can support us by buying these incredible t-shirts and sweatshirts with either the JTB tagline and logo or an inspirational saying made by me and a previous guest in a previous episode. The choice is yours. All you have to do is choose your color, your size, and whether you want the logo and the tagline or the inspirational saying, it'll all be sent to you conveniently straight to your front door and include shipping and handling. Now. Before we get on with today's episode, we're going to have a word from our sponsor, so please stay with us. Hey, I'm Jeanette Burke from Jeanette's TV and Jeanette's TV Podcast, back at the red carpets at the Canadian Screen Actors Award, where I have to be dressed. So, thank you to Sachet Boutique in the heart of Thornhill at Young and Center for another amazing outfit that has helped me stand out. If you have a special event coming on and you want to stand out, Go visit Sheba. She will help you with her incredible collection of beautiful designer gowns and cocktail dresses from all the best European designs at very affordable prices. From the perhaps now former CTV chief news anchor, let's take a look at what she had to say herself about this matter. On June 29th, I was informed that Bell Media made a quote, business decision to end my contract, bringing to a sudden close my long career with CTV News. I was blindsided and am still shocked and saddened by Bell Media's decision. I was also asked to keep this confidential from my colleagues and the public until the specifics of my exit could be resolved. That has now happened and, and I want you to know what these last 35 years have meant to me. Everything. So there you go. I mean, you heard her saying that she was blindsided. <laughs> and uh, Lisa, it's just an honor to meet you and interview you. And my question, I only get one, okay. is this. What one message would you like all us women who are trying to make it in this journalism world to, to, to understand from you and your experience? I would say, wow, one message. It's hard for me to boil it down. But I only get one question. To boil it down to one message. I would say we have to work on supporting each other. We have to work on self-acceptance, being confident and strong in what we offer. We're in no one's shadow. And what do you say about, you know, people who get told they're too fat or they're too ethnic looking or what have you and they can't move forward? How do you think we could change that? I think we call it out. Naming is shaming. If someone says something like that, you got to call it out. Like that's the only way to shame people into shutting up or improving their tone. I mean, we all have a responsibility for civility and respect. That is very well said. And I wouldn't expect anything less from you. Thank you so much. Lovely to meet you. Thank you so much. Take care. Thank you. Have a good night. Thanks for being with us today on Jeanette's TV and Jeanette's TV Podcast. I'm your host, Jeanette Burke, signing off. Please remember to like, comment, and share all our posts with your family and friends. You will find us everywhere on the streaming side, Facebook, LinkedIn, Pinterest, YouTube, Vimeo, Instagram, and the list goes on. On the podcast audio side, you will find us on iHeartRadio, Apple, Anchor, Buzzsprout, BuzzFeed, and so many more. For a complete list of where to watch and listen to us, please check the link in the show notes below. And until next time, continue to be fabulous. Yeah.